Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2017 here in Busan in the Republic of Korea where I'm very pleased to be joined Mr. RJ Choi who is the CFO for Moneybrain. Mr. Choi, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Okay. Thank you for your invitation to this surprise interview. I'm the CFO of the Moneybrain. Our general question is, uh, what is the Moneybrain? What industry is it? The simple answer is this. Money is related with financial institutions and brain is related with artificial intelligence. That is, our company name is related with artificial intelligence for specified financial institutions. Great. Now, the, the, the uh, theme here at ITU Telecom World is smart digital transformation. What does that mean to you? It means, uh, from the perspective of our company, that is the erosion of app adder to AI industry. This time is the, the starting point of AI industry, which is artificial intelligence that it gives us a lot of opportunities and also the financial institutions and other business domains also can acquire those uh, benefits uh, using the AI technologies. And why is AI important in financial services and how can it benefit the financial industry? Okay. We can separate uh, two different parts. First one is cost reduction, and second one is revenue increase. Let's talk about the first part. The first part is the cost reduction. If financial company introduce AI technologies in their call centers, uh, they can tremendously reduce uh, their cost. But at this time, there is a cooperation between human and artificial intelligence. They can help each other. For example, if the clients call through that call center, then AI can receive the call. And so if they cannot finish their counseling, then the human can support it and finish the counseling. And second methods, human can receive the phone call directly from their clients. And during their counseling, AI can search and so do the analysis, deep analysis during the counseling time and then can give, us, give them the specific and optimal solution. That is the first part. And second one, second one is more aggressive. That is an increase in revenue. Especially it is related with marketing and sales. One of our clients are doing it very well is they are using that AI technologies to do the special events and marketing activities. Hence, uh, it can separate these uh, three different stages. Firstly, it is uh, text-based. And second matter is uh, it is related with the legacy system of the financial institutions because they are concerned about the security. And then final step is uh, to increase to the human wise this uh, level of uh, AI technologies that is our targets in the future. Great. And now, what's the, wanted to find out from you, what's the value of attending events such as ITU Telecom World? Yeah. Mm. We are targeting the global market currently because we already have uh, domestic, the Korean references, uh, including the Nongya Bank and Xinan Cars. We launched this AI service uh, in Korea for the first time for the financial companies, and we are trying to get further references in global markets. That's why we are attending this ITU conference and also we are planning to attend different conferences uh, in China next month. Great. And have you got a key message here to the participants at ITU Telecom World? Yeah. The key message is this. AI technology is not anymore option but obligation. So it's a mandatory. If you introduce AI technology in your company in financial sectors especially, then you can reduce costs and increase revenue. And the timing is very important because if you introduce uh, AI technology, it requires uh, experience and the data sets. If we have more information and data sets than our AI technology 
especially the chatbot, uh, our brand name is uh, Play, Play Chats, they can have more deep learning process. We have a specific methods, for example, dialogue management, LNU, or the, and also we have the deep learning technologies. So if we have the more information and data set, then we can get provides more advanced technologies. And there are currently two different uh, sectors uh, for the AI technologies. Uh, for example, the first aspect is uh, doing the general, general AI technologies. And they are doing the general services uh, in all services, business domains. Uh, but we are focusing on the finance sectors uh, and we are providing the specific sectors after financial sectors, and we are also covering it in different sectors as well. For example, shopping malls, or the medicals, or the public sectors. And we are trying to expand it to the global markets. That's why I'm here. Any final comments before we go? Yeah, uh, you want to ask this final comment. We want to contribute the convergence of AI and finance in the future as we have done before. Thank you for your precious time. We well, wish you the very best of the future and I'm sure that uh, you'll do very well. But thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you for your invitation to your precious interview. Thank you. Thank you.